hello and welcome to this tutorial in this tutorial we will discuss about a one advanced option which is called our right for example if we have a current dimension style and we need in the current dimension style some other type of dimension then we can use our right option for example i am going to check first of all click on the annotate option and from here you can easily select your default dimension style or if you create your new dimension style you can select it from here so let me select the annotate you or standard one so let's select the standard and from here we will click on the dimension and once we click on the dimension we can see that this is our dimension style but okay so now in the current dimension style in the standard if i am going to press d from my keyboard or i can go from here the manage dimension style so the same as it is i can press d shortcut from my keyboard so now this pop-up menu is open from here we can see the our right option okay so what is the purpose of our right in the same standard we will get some temporary dimension style so this pop-up menu will open from here you can change the color for example i'm going to click this one and from here you can change each and everything as i explained in previous video so now let me just change this some arrows and setting in the current dimension setting for example i'm pressing 0 0.3 and from here just let me press it and so let me press here 0 0.25 and press enter okay and now i am going to the text and from here i will change the text size 0 0.25 the same as it is and from here i will change the standard for the text style and here i can just select the yellow color for the text so it will be more clear so let me click on ok button and now you can see here in the same standard style we get the style all right okay so now class now close and go to the dimension and click here and click from here to here so now you can see that you are getting this dimension style so the text is let me change the text okay so the same we need to modify and from here we will just press 0 0.10 okay and we will change also the arrow size 0 0.10 okay and from here we will go to the primary unit and from here we will just select it 0 0.01 so it's just for the explanation purpose so it's changed now we will just go again to let's delete this one and from here we will go to the dimension and from here to here we will just measure like this now you can see that your this style is different from this but we have select we have set or standard so same as it is you can do you can also even create again a second or right if you want to if you need again or right you can just select and do the same settings so if you change the if you rename this or right it will convert to new style for example i am entering abc new style and now if you click here you can see that it's created to the new style so ctrl z close here and press ctrl z and d now you can see that it's all right the same as it is so if you want to delete you can just easily delete it from here so this why we are using this for example if in one standard text style if you need few type of text you can just create our right for example i am going to create again another so let me just change only the color for the text then you will see the difference okay press enter and close now you will see that it will be different from the another one okay click here now you can see that this text is red this text is 1.5 is yellow and here is white but it's the same standard style you can see it from here if you click enter d you can see that the standard is selected there is no any other style so for this purpose we are using the all right i hope this is helpful we will see in the next tutorial goodbye and take care